Alright, Snake. Give me an update, boy. Well, allergy season has arrived in the Alabama wildlife woods. <laughs> uh, sleeping in for some reason. 30, 30 what? It's gotta be 36. at least 30 degrees right now. I think it's 36 is the low in the 26, morning. 26 if you ask me. <laughs> I get to sleep with a giant grizzly bear. Oh, man. All just to chase a bird with big feathers. <laughs> I bet they're chattering tonight, too, though. I don't even know we crawl. <laughs> we got the old Jackery to charge our cell phones. <laughs> A thousand watt jackery to yeah. make sure cell phones charge. <laughs> One at a time. I thought there's a headstone in here. <laughs> got a 12 volt battery. But we're sleepy, so good night. another one. Buddy, they're going at her right now. Down the end. Yeah. Good job, one more time. Back this day, y'all. Good God, buddy. I can hear them. They're straight that way. All of them. All of them.
turkeys over the ridge to the left.
Just flick this off. I you turned that off? Yes, I ran it for 15 minutes. I and thought that was on the whole time. And it calmed down. And I was afraid because I couldn't see the turkey. I was afraid to reach up and turn it on. Yeah. Anyway, just to, I guess, to recap it. I tried to, anyway. Which they saw early, but long story short, we walked through the saddle. These turkeys were in earlier. And got up on the high side. And Jake, we had. All of a sudden, I don't know what time it was, but the turkeys had shut up off the lamp. What was it, probably seven? Yeah. Eight? I guess I'm on, I don't know what time it is. I'm on Georgia time still. I ain't on Georgia time. seven fifty nine. so right at seven o'clock, I mean, yeah. every turkey in the woods started going. Yep. Yeah. I mean, they just started burning it down. We heard one turkey gobble several times down there. Heard one back over here, down in there, and then Jake, he needs to learn to speak up, but he said he heard one drumming. But before that, right before he told me that, there was one gobble. I mean, right over, how far was it? Maybe 50? Yeah, at right the over most. The crest of this kind of, I don't know what I'd call a knob or whatever you want to call it, but on the high side of the saddle. So we, we wrapped it and got on the shady side so we'd be out of the sun. And I yelped, and there's two of them going, pow, pow. And they're probably, what, at that point, 60 yards, maybe. Yeah. And, uh, and then we let them, you know, gave them some time, probably, what, five minutes later. I, they, wouldn't, they weren't gobbling at soft stuff, so I had to kind of yelp at them pretty hard to get them to gobble, just to see where they're at. And they gobbled right off, kind of, they, it was like, acting like they were wrapping around to the saddle. Yeah. And uh, so we, all, we both turned and got both of our guns ready. Cause we knew there was two, and <laughs> we were sitting there, and, and I kept trying to make them gobble like an idiot, and they shut up. They were down there strutting. Um, that's when it'd be nice to be able to hear them, hear them drum, drumming good. But anyway, we hear something behind us. <laughs> Jake, Jake's like, "There's a turkey." <laughs> and there's a hen that walked up. I mean, right behind us, she was 20 yards. We were kind of fiddling with her, and then Jake looked back down through the saddle, and he said, "A gobbler." Coming right at us, 50 yards, 50 yards. A nice one. <laughs> He's a he nice one, buddy. He said that like 10 times. He's like, it's a nice one. <laughs> like, like they look any different. But it is a nice one. I'll tell you, boy. It's a nice one. <laughs> <laughs> look at that, dude. I mean, that ain't no two year old turkey, boy. Big turkey. Sweet. But his buddy, we were trying to wait. Cause we knew there was two and his buddy i wasn't trying to wait <laughs> I was just trying. Was like, don't let this turkey go you kill it when you can and i was like i'm gonna try to wait to let the other one catch up and i'll shoot the back one but he got in this road and i mean he was he was gonna pick us out most likely which we had a good backdrop looking back at it but you get two rednecks on a pine tree in the yeah, open I, it don't take long for these boys. I, I wasn't sitting still much longer either <laughs> I was catching hip cramps and my arm was getting tired because I was holding on my weight up. It's just crazy, man, because, like, we were talking about it. You just got to be where the turkeys want to be. Yeah. Um, where, the, where you're yelping from, man. You just, you can't call turkeys up to anywhere. And we knew that this was a place where we could kill a turkey. Because that time this morning, he was going back and forth from his finger to this saddle. And, and that old boy, he, he was roosted here, so he came through here yesterday evening, but... You just gotta be where they where they want to be. I mean, you can be the best caller in the world, but if you ain't where the turkeys want to be and want to eat or want to strut or want to gobble whatever, they ain't gonna come up there. I mean, yeah. you might have a couple of two-year-olds that want to do something stupid, but you just gotta be where they want to be. So 
we ended up being within range of where they wanted to be, with a pretty good hide, and they ended up shutting up, but they finally committed. So I just hate we didn't get both of them, but we saw that other turkey running off. He, he was probably 50 yards behind this turkey, but the way it laid out, we just couldn't get a, another shot on him. No regrets here. Old mountain turkey spurs. I oh, know. Big old rundown. Just big old dual things. Just look how big those legs are, man. I know they're thick. Yeah. About way thicker than that bird that I killed last weekend. Imagine if you ran up and down these hills for a living. Fair enough. Yeah. I feel like the one I killed was like his spurs was way sharper and slicker than they, they are. are. Yeah, they are. I don't know the reasoning behind it, but typically mountain turkeys have those short fats. You know, yeah. spurs and those field turkeys. A lot of times, what I've seen, is they'll have those curved long, round. You know, just yeah. super, super sharp. But yeah. he's a fine one, buddy. He, I don't think he's coming back to life. No, that <laughs> one's done. <laughs> oh man, check his pulse. I mean, good. I am mighty fine turkey. Dude. Well, hold him out. Let everybody see him. Big turkey cow, dog. Mm. Mm. <laughs> oh, wait. <laughs> I was zoomed in on his spurs <laughs> the whole time you was holding them like that. He does have some hooks, though. I mean, they ain't super long or nothing. They're just, they're just a big turkey. Yeah, absolutely. <laughs> That ain't no two-year-old turkey, you know. No. Not that I cared if it was or wasn't. 